On average, six new people are becoming homeless in Dublin on a daily basis. Recent statistics in Ireland have shown almost 4,000 people were living in accommodation, providing shelter for homeless persons or sleeping rough. If I had a gun, I'd blow my head off because I'm down this and I'm seven day and I don't want to be down this. I want to get in and get off the tablets that I'm taking, the similar vein that has the whole city nearly round with them, yeah. But anyway, I want to get, I know I can do better for my life, but I can't get that chance. In a recent survey, almost one third of homeless people recorded their health as being very poor, compared with 10% of the general population. There are many reasons currently why a person may become homeless in Dublin. These include poverty, unemployment and lack of quality housing. Here behind me in Dublin city centre is a landmark, the Haypenny Bridge, where on a daily basis you will find a homeless person. I'm sleeping out where I had my flat, where I lost my flat, in, it was in the inchy car, yeah. So I'm kind of sleeping rough around the inchy car area. And, um, yeah, it's dangerous it is, yeah. I've been attacked a couple of times before, you know, quite viciously, randomly. The Father Peter McVerry Trust is a charity set up to reduce homelessness. Focus Ireland, uh, who, d who primarily deal with families who become homeless, have seen a tripling of the number of families that they're dealing with compared to this time last year. And uh, so there's a huge increase in homelessness and the exits out of homelessness are all clogged up. This is Sean Dunn, UTV Ireland, Dublin.